Hi everybody, welcome to the LSI point. So in today's video, we are going to talk about analog design engineer profile. What are the roles and responsibility of an analog design engineer? What is the career growth? What is future scope? What is the salary hike? Everything we will discuss in today's video. So if you are watching my videos first time, don't forget to subscribe VLSI point because here you will get all the VLSI related content. Also, you can join our community on Telegram group and discuss your small, small doubts with peers. For one to one interaction, you can connect with me on LinkedIn and Instagram. So starting with what is analog design engineer profile? So an analog design engineer specializes in the designing and development of analog circuits and systems. These circuits are essential for processing the real world signals like audio, video and radio frequency. Unlike to digital circuits that work on zeros and ones, analog circuits work with continuous signals and that make it more complex. So yes, we can say analog design engineer plays a critical role in electronic industry by working on fundamental elements of multiple analog devices. With high demand, promising career growth, competitive salary hike and bright future scope, this field offers a dynamic career path to all those who are passionate in electronics and circuit design. Talking about the roles and responsibilities of an analog design engineer. So first is circuit design. They design and develop analog circuits like oscillators, amplifiers, filters and power management circuits. They optimizes the circuit performance based on the specifications and application requirement. Simulation and analysis. They use simulation tools to model and test the circuits. After the simulation, they analyze the result to identify the potential issues before the fabrication. Layout design. They convert the circuit design into the physical layout for IC fabrication. They ensure that the layout optimizes the interference, noise and power consumption, however maximizes the performance. Testing and validation. So they test the fabricated circuit to check whether it meets all the design specification or not. Troubleshooting and debugging. They identify, diagnose and resolve the issues in the circuit design and fabricated circuit. They implement the design changes and iterate to achieve the desired performance. Along with all these tasks, they collaborate with cross-functional teams like digital designers, product managers and system engineers. They prepare detailed design documentation, including schematic, simulation result and test reports. So this is about the roles and responsibility of an analog design engineer. Now we will see what is the career growth in this field. At entry level, fresh graduates can start their career as a junior analog design engineer or analog design trainees. They assist senior design engineers learn tools and methodologies and working on smaller design tasks. At mid-level, with three to five years of experience, you can move your roles to the analog design engineer or senior analog design engineer. At this level, you have to handle more complex designs, lead smaller projects and mentor junior engineers. Senior roles include lead analog design engineer, principal engineer or analog design manager. Their responsibilities include handling multiple projects, also leading the design team and strategic planning. With significant experience, you can enter into the leadership roles like director of engineering or chief technology officer that is CTO. They focuses on high level management, business strategies and innovations. The demand of skilled analog design engineers are very high due to the advancement in technologies and growing electronic industries. Companies are seeking specialists who can design efficient analog circuits. What is the salary hike in this field? So at entry level, you can expect a salary between four to eight LPA. At mid-level, with two to three years of experience, it ranges between 8 to 15 LPA. At senior level, it uh, quite ranges between 15 to 30 LPA and for leadership positions, it would be even more than 30 LPA. Remember one thing guys, this is a rough figure which I am telling to you. 
your salary can vary depending upon your specialty your skills the company in which you have joined or the project on which you are working so focus on your skills your salary will completely depend on that talking about the future scope so in india electronic manufacturing industry is growing rapidly and driving demands for skilled analog design engineers government initiatives like make in india digital india increased r&d investment also fueling this growth technological advancement emerging technologies like 5g autonomous vehicles renewable energy systems and smart devices these requires a very high level analog design skills innovations in these areas will continue to create opportunities for analog design engineers research and development increasing focus on r&d by both multinational and domestic companies in india offers an ample opportunity for engineers to work on cutting edge technologies collaboration with academic institutions and research labs also provide avenues to work in this field startup and entrepreneurship india's vibrant startup ecosystem offers opportunities to engineers to work in innovative environment or to even start their own ventures analog design skills are critical for developing new hardware solutions and products if you are willing to start your career in analog field then these are the subjects which you need to study and to make a very strong command first is network theory or circuit theory in this subject you will learn about the kcl kvl ohm's law how current is flowing how you can measure the voltage and different types of network theorems so you will basically study in this subject how you can analyze an electronic circuit and these are the fundamentals to understand more complex design next is electronic devices and circuits in this subject you will learn about the devices how pn junction works how mosfet works what is the concept of mos capacitors so by focusing in this subject you will understand how these components can be used to develop an entire circuit next is analog integrated circuit in this you will learn about different different circuits like oscillators filters amplifiers well if you guys are confused which book to refer for these subjects then you can watch this video here i have explained in detail what books can be used what subjects are important for your interview point of view next is signal processing so in this subject you will learn how signals are manipulated and transformed into an electronic system control system subject is also important to get a more idea about the feedback about the loops about the stability because eventually you have to design a stable and reliable analog circuit so knowledge of control system is very important next is advanced vlsi design so in this subject you will learn about cmos inverter what is their characteristic how this technology works then your fabrication process steps involved in that so understanding these principles are compulsory one more important subject is there which is static timing analysis being an analog design engineer you have to focus on timing whether your circuit is performing all the required operations or not whether your operations are on time or not so for that it's very important to have a good command a very strong command on static timing analysis what tools you guys need to learn so spice simulators like lt spice h spice p spice then your cadence verduso mentor graphics matlab these all tools will be more than enough so try to make different different projects and make a good command on all these tools to enhance your knowledge and skills you can join online courses too and for that you can check coursera udemy and nptel websites nptel swayam is providing multiple courses and that i have already explained in this video so check out the video and register for the course here is the list of companies working on analog side Texas Instruments, Analog Devices, Maxim Integrated, 
इंपीनियन टेक्नोलॉजीज ऑन सेमी कंडक्टर एस टी माइक्रो इलेक्ट्रॉनिक्स एन एक्स पी सेमी कंडक्टर्स ब्रॉडकॉम स्काई वर्क सोल्यूशन क्वालकॉम एंड मच मोर कंपनीज आर देयर योर नेक्स्ट स्टेप वुड बी टू वर्क ऑन गुड लेवल प्रोजेक्ट एंड एड दो प्रोजेक्ट ऑन योर पोर्टफोलियो आफ्टर दैट यू कैन स्टार्ट अप्लाइंग इन कंपनीज सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल check the career page on the official website of these companies there you will get all the jobs and internship related updates along with that other platforms are also there like linkedin nokri.com indeed glassdoor internshala so there also you will get multiple opportunities for the jobs and internships but the only thing required is a strong profile keep updating your profile and add industry related keywords here is the list of keywords related to the analog domain so you can choose as per the company's requirement and add into your resume and your profile too so this is it guys this is about today's video we have discussed analog design engineer profile in detail if you like today's video then hit the like button and also suggest me the next video topic keep study and keep watching the lsi point See you soon in the next video.